Yo, what is going on everyone? It is Atorius here. Sorry, I'm just trying to set some stuff up. Um, today we're going to be talking about... Uh, I don't really even know how to pronounce this thing. Whether it's... Sios Or... I, I have no idea, so I'm not going to try. Um, but uh, in the description below is, of course, the little bit of wiki snap uh, on Sios itself. So that'll kind of give you guys a little bit of information on that. Um, and let's get to it, shall we? Give me just one second here. Hello, Eugene. Oh, keep dokey. Let's get rid of. Okay, now that I got everything up to this, so oh, to give you guys kind of a little bit of geography here, uh, there's the island on which you guys start on right now currently. Uh, these additional islands have been added in recently. I need to fix that. Uh, so we're over here kind of in between us and where the big redwood forest is going to be. So. Let's go down here and take a look. I'm going to actually turn off the ocean layer so that you guys... Well, hold on just one second here. I'm doing everything on a single monitor because that's the only way the dev kit will let me test. Um, so I'm going to turn off uh, I'll actually be turning off the ocean layer so we can actually see. That's weird, it keeps. What's it keep doing? That's so odd. So, um. This is. Sios. Um. <clears throat> so. I, I kind of decided to take. One of the ideas from the center with the underwater air bubbles, and was like, "Hey, you know, Sios is a perfect area for that because it was a city that's sunken, um, and was later found by Arthur Dennison." So let's get in there and look at this and see what we got here. So there's only one way into this underwater chasm. Let's see if I can find it here. Ah, yes, here it is. So, also turn off these levels. Alrighty, let's get in there and look at this bad boy. So, you swim in through this entrance over here. Swim in, up, and here we go. So, there's actually a blocking volume here on both sides. That'll prevent you from swimming through. Uh, now, I haven't figured out a door mechanic or anything that I would like to use per se um, to kind of equal this transition period. Uh, Alright, 
it looks like I'm having some a little bit of technical difficulty. I will be right back. Okay, everyone, we are back. I, uh, I'm sorry about that. Uh, we had a little bit of issue. Uh, like I said, I think it was just a connection thing, so I reset the router and stuff like that. Uh, so, uh, let's get back to it. I have a hard time finding this entrance, and I built it. Uh, da, 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 da. There it is. So like I said before, uh, there was blocking volumes and stuff like that to kind of keep, um, keep you from going to either side of this. But here's the transitional period here. So we're going to come right on in, we should drop color, and there we go. Um, now to get some light in here, edit. So in this area here, you can... Thanks, brother. Appreciate it. Uh, in this area here, you can totally, uh, you can breathe, you can walk around. Um, I don't want you guys to wait like the 30 minutes that it takes to get me in. So this is just kind of a brief overview of this area. Um, so this area is not buildable. You're not allowed to block anything or anything like that. You'll not be able to build anything in this area here. Um, this rock, however, is set to ground. This rock needs shrunk. Take this wonderful light. So we'll have some crystals up here, um, almost like makeshift sunstones um, that'll give this area light uh, in certain areas. Um, <clears throat> Like I said, really haven't done anything down here. Uh, this area is huge, by the way. Um, just to give you an idea on scale. Actually, let's just do this with something I know. Now this is a normal sized trike that you would see. Um, it's not been scaled up or anything. Just to kind of give you a little bit of scale on how big this area is. Now this center pillar here is set to ground as well, or it will be here in a second. Should be already, yeah, it's already set to ground. Um, and this whole area is obviously ocean floor, so it is also set to ground. Um, 
So like I said, this area is going to be huge for you guys to build in. Uh, I will be putting a little bit of ruins in here. Uh, but other than that, you know, this base will be completely open to you guys. Um, yo, Imzy. <clears throat> so like I said, it's just giving you an idea that, you know, how really big this area is. Um, uh, other than that, I will not be touching this area. So, um... It kind of leads everything up to you guys. Uh, I was thinking about putting in like a big ruin area here and a lot of loot and stuff like that, but decided against it. Uh, I'd much rather let you guys use your imagination and and run crazy with this and uh, fix you know fix it how you would like. Uh, I will be kind of flattening everything out here a little bit. It won't be completely flat. It will be. It will have some hills and stuff in it. Um, <clears throat> I will be also putting in uh, a uh, kind of like a waterfall. Uh, maybe. I want to put some sort of water source in here so you guys don't have to go run up there and out to get water. Um, whether it be something, you know, very tiny. Um, and then, of course, there'll be some stone down here, some metal, some crystal, uh, maybe a little bit of obsidian, um, and then a few trees, because uh, why not, you know, it's just because the island sank uh, with the light from the crystals should be okay at preserving enough light to, to create that photosynthesis, I would think, to, uh, uh, to make stuff gun. Um, yeah, this whole area, I mean, this this area, like I said, will be completely open and buildable. Um, as for doing a PvP or RP there, Eugene, uh, it just, it, anyone can then take this map and, and do what they want uh, with it as a server. Uh, any map additions or whatnot would have to be done by me. Um, but we can, we can talk about that on the side and uh, discuss what you guys think would be uh, best because I'm always up to new ideas oh hey let's not go that cray cray with it come back here So the area that I've designed, I've put a couple little ledges here so that you guys can kind of grapple here and then grapple up, because um, otherwise you cannot grapple straight up to this thing. Uh, I've, I've tried, it just does not work. So <clears throat> you will have to kind of step as it was um, to get up to those areas. Let's get some grass going on in here.
Um, I I could very well, yeah, use those. Um, I was just gonna see what they had available. Um, but yeah, they'll they'll be those nice, like, bright, white looking ones that it hurts to look at, which will give off that nice sun like state. Um, I thought about, you know, borrowing the center sun, but Dinotopia doesn't have that referenced, so we will just roll with what they give us. Right. Uh, let me see if I have if I have that level loaded up. I'll show you what crystals I was thinking in mind. It might take me a second to load in that level. Oh, I do have it loaded. Let me just save real quick.
shooting star got more than a couple of people going mad i swear they're rooting hard tell them i'd be big in a game like she went and got them breast implants i said i'm moving too fast didn't even get a glance i'm ready to eat up track like i'm seated in a restaurant yeah. if you have swag like mine you know it's best to flaunt yeah. I think that looks pretty good for what we need. Um, now to bring in the trees.
Oh yeah, those do look better. Yeah, I'll grab those.
Hey Pawn, how's it going?
Now the reason why those are showing up black is because technically we're underwater, so it's not going to show up very nicely. So what I will have to do is I will have to get a new mesh for them. Or I may not put any in here altogether. Well, as I am how I like to keep things a uh, little bit secretive, I'm not going to show you guys the ruins. Um, I'm actually in the process of building those off-site, so I can just put them in and drop them. Uh, so I will not be showing you guys those, however I will show you a few changes I made, being I have Pawn on here. As well as I think MZ's still, still on here. So I have put a custom blocking volume on all of these. So now no more big boxes. Uh, Big trees are on here. They may be. Oh. Are they on that level? Oh. Probably put them on the other level. They are probably on this one. Nope. I don't know where your big trees went. Uh, so, I will re put in the big trees. There was one up here, there was one over here, one over there, one over here, and then here's the one I was talking about for MZ over there that she had asked about. So, uh, yep, that's pretty much it um, on the changes wise. Uh, so, well, I hope to see you guys following me. Make sure you hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, share with your friends. Um, any suggestions or anything like that, please leave me a comment below or uh, message me on discord and get with me um, I'm all for importing other people's ideas and uh, making this more of a community map than just something I make so uh, everyone have a wonderful weekend uh, take care breathe deep seek peace